What's up, beautiful and amazing people, and I am pleased to welcome you to my state-of-the-art YouTube Creator Studio for the first time ever. Let me show you around. First, let's start with the foundation of my entire setup. My studio is built upon this beautiful 60-inch uplift standing desk. This desk has been an absolute game changer. A small disclaimer though, these desks are very expensive and I would only recommend buying one if you are a busy professional and can afford it. Let's move on from the foundation of the studio into the engine that powers the entire operation. This is where all of the magic happens. Every single video, including this one, that you watch on the Elite Tech and Elite Goldhorns YouTube channels was created right here. This thing is an absolute powerhouse. Equipped with the M1 Max chip, 64 gigabytes of RAM, and two terabytes of storage, this MacBook Pro handles all of my multimedia creation needs without even breaking a sweat. The MacBook is mounted to a FlexiMounts monitor arm using the Amazon Basics Notebook Laptop Mount Tray. This setup allows me to maximize desk space and use my laptop from many different heights and angles. Another integral component of the studio setup is my under-desk mounted CalDigit USB-C Pro docking station. This versatile piece of hardware allows me to use my MacBook Pro as more of a desktop style computer. The dock enables me to run multiple monitors and various other USB power devices all simultaneously on one simple Thunderbolt 4 cable. From the docking station onto the screens they help power, I've had these LG 25 inch 21 by 9 aspect ratio monitors for quite a while now. I absolutely love these monitors and the way I have them set up, one stacked on top of the other. These monitors have vastly improved my video editing capabilities and overall productivity tenfold. Directly to the left of the LG ultrawide monitors, you'll notice a floating 2020 12.9 inch iPad Pro. Yes, that's right, you heard me correctly, a floating iPad. How cool is that? This iPad attaches magnetically to the arm and can be easily removed if I ever need to grab it. Believe it or not, nobody actually makes a product that accomplishes this goal. As you can see, this system is super jerry-rigged, but it looks incredibly professional from the front. This setup makes the iPad an incredibly useful multitasking tool. In fact, I frequently use it as a fourth monitor when completing highly complicated tasks. Below the floating iPad Pro, you may have noticed the smaller 2021 9th gen base model iPad. I picked up this iPad late last year and it has been a nice complement to my studio setup. I frequently use this iPad as a supplemental tool to complete smaller tasks like quick Google searches, watching sporting events, or reading through emails. Given the iPad's smaller size and lighter weight, it allows for a more enjoyable in-hand tablet experience than the larger iPad Pro. Going even smaller, the iPhone 12 Pro has been my daily driver since November 2020 and has played a pivotal role in video production for elite entertainment. <laughs> It offers good professional grade cameras that help capture footage for videos. In fact, the video you are watching right now was shot almost entirely using the iPhone 12 Pro cameras. The audio you are hearing right now was recorded on the HyperX Quadcast S RGB microphone. While not ranked the highest mic on the market, the sound quality is superb in my opinion. In addition to the great audio quality, this device offers customizable RGB lights built directly into the microphone. The mic is mounted onto the desk via the Aokio AK35 microphone stand. The Sony WH-1000XM4s are considered by many to be the best over-ear consumer grade headphones on the market. The noise cancellation technology is fantastic and the sound quality is top notch. My only complaint with these headphones is the Bluetooth tech inside. The headphones don't always play very nicely with my other devices. Another key component of my daily operation is the Logitech MX Master 3. This is hands down the best wireless mouse available right now on the market. 
Once you have experienced the horizontal scrolling on this mouse, there is no going back. It is an incredibly useful feature for editing video and audio, browsing large web pages, and reviewing data in Excel spreadsheets. The overall ergonomics of this mouse make it extremely comfortable to use for hours on end without cramping or pain. I have never used a better mouse than this in my entire life. I recently picked up the Keychron K3 mechanical keyboard and I like it a lot. It works really nicely with both my MacBook Pro for Elite Entertainment as well as my Lenovo ThinkPad for my day job. Switching between devices is also super easy. I have not customized anything on the keyboard yet, but if you have any recommendations, please let me know in the comment section below. Directly above the Keychron K3, you'll notice the Elgato Stream Deck with 15 customizable LCD keys. I would say the Stream Deck has been more of a fun and somewhat gimmicky device for the most part, but I still really enjoy having it in my setup. I have programmed in some useful hotkeys for multimedia production. These hotkeys have certainly improved efficiency and ease of use. In addition to that, I use my Stream Deck to play goal horns when watching hockey games. <laughs> By now, you've probably noticed those beautiful colored mood lights. To create this effect, I used an array of three Philips Hue Play light bars mounted behind the LG ultrawide monitors on my desk. In addition to this, I mounted a 55 inch Hue gradient light strip to the back side of my TV. I used to be a Philips Hue hater, but they have turned me into a believer. While I still think these lights are a bit overpriced, the quality is wonderful. They add so much color and vibrancy to my studio. I don't regret buying these lights for even a minute. While some of the items you have seen so far may not be necessary for your purposes, one very important tool we could all use in our lives is a good desk chair. For this, I chose the Staples Emerge Vortex Bonded Leather Gaming Chair. Even though I'm not a gamer, this chair is super comfortable and extremely ergonomically friendly. Although the desk chair is very comfortable, I surprisingly don't spend the majority of my time sitting in it while at my desk. Here at Elite Tech, we take physical health very seriously. It is my daily goal to walk, jog, or run at least 10,000 steps every single day. Balancing a full-time job, two YouTube channels, going to the gym regularly, Playing ice hockey and having a good social life is very difficult. This treadmill has made it possible to meet my fitness standards and get all of my work done on a regular basis. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the notifications bell. If you enjoyed this video or have any questions, please let me know down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.